blown up volcano this crater happened the deepness of this lake is 169 meters maybe uh, one of the deepest lake in the Turkey I would love to emphasize why Salda is important banks of this lake the surrounding shows the last millennium uh, what happened in the area layers of the ground tells us a lot it's a special Hydro magnesite mineral found in its coastal waters, which is believed to be offer uh, remedies for certain dermatological diseases. The lake has its own some special birds, and its peculiar morphology has led to a number of academic studies conducted on Salda Lake. The unusual alkaline nature of the lake means that is one of the few locations where ancient stroke light algae still grows that means lake still producing that special uh, element that's why it's uh, important so no sun cream on the lake no food no drink even the humankind shouldn't enter this lake we bringing a lot of bacteria here and changing the, the chain the harmony inside and this area has some special birds and some uh, botanical stuff only up to here grows here endemic things but what's going on is you know we are living on the age of populism when some place become popular everybody runs into that area well now Salda Lake is under discussion, because of this discussion, took a lot of attention here. Not only local people, especially Turkish people living in Europe, they coming summertime for holiday and they staying here. Another thing is, not much facilities around the lake. It's just very new, very new. Not that much uh, hotel, pension, nothing. So a couple of camping area area around, owned by the local mayorship. Well. I'm worried, yes, I am worried as well. Seeing the people smoking on the lake, that worries me even more. And putting sun cream. Each year I'm coming here, I know that Salda Lake is going to lose its beauty a little bit, then blown up, like everywhere else. Popularism. I think all I can say, now it's time to drive to Fethiye, Ölü Deniz. Bye. Stuck in money like this is fine.